Hello everyone, it's Shane Kanto, your Wasteland reviewer, and I'm here to review the new documentary, Commitment to Life, from director Jeffrey Schwartz, and focusing on the history of HIV AIDS, this epidemic that killed so many people, and this film, over the course of its about two hour runtime, tells basically the step-by-step -step history from when it first started popping up and all the way up until we started having real tangible treatments and this film in many ways is paint by the numbers kind of documentary documentary storytelling but what I feel like one this is such an important story to tell and give context but I also think it's its reliance on people there's different people that we really get a chance to spend time with and get to know and see the human side of this disease and of course this film also has a ridiculously a ridiculous amount of celebrities in it in archival footage and Tom Hanks narrating it and because this does look at it through the backdrop of the commitment to life movement these charity events that racked up so much money for research and also just looking at how the government President Reagan just kind of put a blind eye to this for so long and how Hollywood finally turned it around and started helping out in this situation Elizabeth Taylor is like a big piece of this Rock Hudson is a big piece of this Magic Johnson like those crucial moments in cultural zeitgeist of America that really helped tip the scale to see like the big picture celebrity of our country bringing it down to the very street level human existence and realizing like we need to do something about this and I think this film does an interesting job of balancing those two places because it does continue the story of like how society as a whole had to shift and do something about this a big one was the election of Bill Clinton who really put a spotlight on trying to make sure that something was done about this and then we do get that very human intimate level interviewing survivors and who thanks to these medications that finally were researched can still live meaningful and relatively healthy lives today and this whole experience, this story, it's tackling a lot. And it packs a lot into two hours. And I think it leans heavily on that traditional feel of a documentary to be able to convey that. But in the end, this is a moving, informational, and informative documentary that really makes an impact and makes you think about things. And I think that's the most important thing when those credits start rolling. But those are my thoughts on commitment to life let me know what you think and let's talk some movies but thank you as always for tuning in and supporting your wasteland reviewer